being in higher education and specifically at research institutions, we have been in these conversations to diversify um, not only the, the student population, but also you know, faculty and staff, as well as administrative staff that are the technology transfer personnel at the university level that help to facilitate from patent all the way through commercialization and licensing. So we look at what obstacles to entry there are in the patent space and in the commercialization space, because the answers to those questions are not always the same. There can be obstacles to patenting that are not the same as obstacles to commercialization. The ability of traditionally underserved populations to secure venture capital, for example, that's a different aspect of innovation inequity than, say, having the ability to have representation and a patent attorney who is filing the patents on your behalf, which is a resources issue, which is a major problem with patent equity. That's why we really support all the pro bono work. We would love mandatory pro bono work for patent attorneys in their services to inventors and others in the patent space that traditionally do not have access to those kinds of resources and that kind of representation and legal advice overall. Thank you.